what's up guys good morning i think you can tell from what i'm doing right now i'm taking breakfast so today is a beautiful day and today we are going to be having an incredible video but i will start with what i'm taking i never showed this when i was preparing the tea but come and show them so i'm taking black tea that's black tea and maize you guys can call it corn this is corn roasted corn is what i'm taking for breakfast yeah, so my name is Harriet Anabo, and if you're new here, you are most welcome, but please consider subscribing. And if you're a returning subscriber, you're the best premier gang, you're the best. So guys, today I'm going to be preparing lunch for my family, our super small family. You guys are going to be seeing each and everything, so please stay tuned. But first, I'll start with taking breakfast before I do any other thing. And, I, and I'm not here alone, I'm also here with... Say hi. Hi. What's your name? My name is Sengba Huntington. Huntington. Yes. yes, Huntington, what are you from doing? Actually, Huntington is from a uh, first hold for me here. Huntington is from uh, tying the goats. Eh? Maybe you should show us the goats yeah. where you've tied them. Because his morning routine, what do you do every morning? I tie the goats the, the other side. Yeah, he ties the goats the other side, guys. That's my home over there. That's my home. So I'm going to be showing you where honey ties his goats. Maybe we should go and show them. What do you think? Hmm? Okay. So guys, we are going to be seeing what honey does. I call him honey in short, but his full name is Huntington. So every morning, honey ties the goats for grazing. Hello. <laughs> That's one of them. That's what he does every morning. Where is another one? Let's go and see it. Oh, there are so many guys. Hmm? So this is what Honey does each and every morning. When he wakes up, he first comes and ties the goats. That's his job. That's your job each and every morning. Yes. Do you enjoy what you do? Okay. I think you do this uh, at your... Because Huntington, guys, is my... He's my son. He calls me auntie. <coughs> hey, excuse me. So where he comes from... Like, do you do this every morning? okay because they just came for holidays guys see see this goat looks so nice and healthy wow is it a male or a female it's a female, it's a female. oh okay <laughs> okay guys so let's go so i'm also here with my niece martha and my nephew hudson hudson say hello hello tell them hello. how are you hello how are you, um, how are you? Oh, mama, what's your name? Martha, what's your name? <laughs> you see, she's also taking bread over here. Hudson, what's your name? What's your full name? Hudson and You look Picture. here, look in the camera. Hudson and Nabo, Picture Hudson and Nabo. Okay, how old are you? Six years. Six years. Guys, you just made six years. I've been posting them like so much. Both of them. This one has made two years and then this one has made six years. This is Hudson. Hudson, would you want a YouTube channel when you grow up? Oh, yeah. you enjoy what I do, right? <laughs> he enjoys being in camera, guys. Like everywhere I go, he enjoys moving with me whenever I'm shooting at home. Hudson, which class have you gone to? P2. P2. Oh, wow. That's nice. Which school? What's the name of your school? Gilgal Primary School. So this one has not yet gone to school, but she's going 2024. Martha. Hi, Mama. How are you? You're fine. <laughs> These are my brother's kids. He's my nephew and she's my niece and I love them so much. Yeah, so you guys can tell even behind us, there are utensils. It's people are like we are trying to first clean and then cook. Yeah, so guys, I think... Um, I'll see you when I'm cooking. Okay, say bye. Bye. Tell them subscribe. 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 Tell them, guys, please subscribe to my auntie's channel. Tell them, please. Please. Guys. Guys. Subscribe. Subscribe. To. to my, my. Auntie's. Auntie. Channel. Say channel. Channel. Look here. Tell them Subscribe. subscribe okay okay tell them bye bye, bye mama bye Martha. 
bye web to the camera bye mama <laughs> okay guys i'll see you when i'm cooking so guys me i'm done with my tea right now and my corn is finished but such is also here say hello to the vlog hi guys mm. Yeah, she's washing the dishes, guys. Before we do any other thing, the first thing here to do is first do the morning routine, like clean and all that. So I wanted to show you what happens, guys, each and every morning. Actually, uh, she's a sister to my sister-in-law. Yeah, so she's also my sister-in-law. But this is what she does each and every morning. Look at Martha. Mama. <laughs> So this is what everyone does each and every morning. Um, Huntington ties the goats. Chisache uh, washes the dishes. And then uh, the Anseno man is doing some other thing, guys. But I think um, we are going... What, what are you cooking today, Sache? Rice and cabbage. Rice and cabbage. Yeah, so today I'm going to be preparing lunch for each and every one. And guys, I want to take you along as I cook lunch. But first, let's first clean the dishes. I think you can see the saucepans are all dirty. So let's such a first clean the dishes and then I'll prepare the lunch for everyone to eat. <coughs> Guys, let me first clean here because this is where I'm going to uh, cook from. Uh. you're going to cook food you have to make sure the environment you're going to cook in is very clean so that's what i'm doing right now i'm going to cook from here so guys today i'm going to be using the charcoal stoves like two of them in order to prepare the food very fast but i'm going to this is the charcoal over here i'm going to be using this charcoal and then these are the charcoal stoves. I'm not going to use the local stones and the firewood. So this is what I'm going to use for today's cooking. So this one is already made, like the fire is already blazing. Okay. Let me light this one and show you how we do it here in Africa. Guys, please remember to like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. And please drop a comment which videos would you want us to shoot when I'm in it. Okay, so today I'm the chef, and then uh, I have an assistant. Hudson is here. Come, he's my assistant for today. Work to them. <laughs> So in case I need anything, I'll be sending Hudson to bring for me everything that I need. Hmm. So this is how we light our charcoal stoves in Africa. In case you don't use the, the, the stones and the firewood, we use these charcoal stoves. They're also good. Okay, but the fire is over blazing. Look at that. Woo. I need to pick the fire from here. Then I put it here. Let me just use a spoon. Eh? Guys, let me just use a spoon because right now I can't use uh, charcoal. The reason why I've used this is because the fire is like, you know, trying to blaze out. So I don't want it to burn me. I would have used the, I would have used this and then I could just carry and put it here. So I think this is enough. Come and show them. Okay. 
yeah so we just add on top that small charcoal add charcoal there so i'm going to use one of this i'm going to use this one charcoal stove to cook food and then the other one to cook the sauce that's why i've used the two of them i don't want my family to eat late that's why i'm eating that uh, that's why i'm using the two of them <coughs> So basically, this is how we do it here in the urban center. But if, in the, if I'm in the village, most of the time I use the stones and firewood. But today I'm going to be using the charcoal stones, guys. So. So guys, today's sauce we are going to be preparing cabbages. I think you can see these are the cabbages. I'm going to be preparing two of them. Just going to be frying them and put some small sauce. You know here in Uganda, our food always has a lot of I don't know if you guys call it soup or sauce. Yeah, so I have to make sure it has some little soup in it. And then onions over here, my spices. I also have uh, tomatoes here. I'm going to wash them. Tomatoes and the green pepper. That is what I'm going to be using for my sauce of the day. So let me first wash them. Let me start with this. You have to make sure they are clean. So going to wash my cabbages. This is how you do it. Like this so it's now clean. Like this. I'm going this one I cannot wash it like this. I'm going to remove this off. So let me first cut my cabbages. Okay, I'll put some here. Buy a little some here, honey. So the spices of the day, I'll be using my tomatoes, onions, the green pepper, and then the carrots over here. And then also the cooking oil. I don't want to show the brand because they have not paid me to promote them. So this is the cooking oil. It's in a socket. Okay, this is what I'm going to use to chop my cabbages. Mama, you want to cook? You want to cook with auntie? Hmm? Mm -hmm. 
style to put. I'm going to first chop it into two pieces. Like this. And then chop it. Like this, they have to be so small. I don't want them too big. If you want, if you don't want to use a knife, you can as well use a grater. But today I don't have a grater, so I'll be using my knife to chop them. Martha. <laughs> Martha, what are you saying? Hmm? Tell my people watching what you're saying. <laughs> so you have to make sure the knife is very sharp, guys, for you to do it very fast. the size once so you do it with the same like even the other cabbage i'll do the same thing you first chop this mother you first first show the camera to this woman here mother what is wrong <laughs> Guys, whenever I'm cooking, this is what I go through whenever I'm cooking from home. You know, we have a lot of kids around, you know. So, if she's over talking, you'll forgive us. <laughs> yeah, but basically, this is how you cut. You cut or you chop. Drop a comment. Let me know. Is it chopping or cutting? Is this chopping or cutting? Cutting. Cutting. Mm. Yeah, I feel like this is chopping. Guys, drop a comment. <laughs> what am I doing? Am I cutting or I'm chopping? Mm -hmm. So this is how you do it here in Africa. When you're trying to cut or chop your cabbage. Like this. also do it the same way drop a comment let me know where you're watching me from and back home wherever you're watching me from do you also do it the same way guys drop a comment isabel how are you you're fine see we have a lot of babies here guys that's when you're learning can you do this yes. nah <laughs> you cannot do this So you have to make sure you don't waste your cabbage. Everything I'm going to chop it. I don't know how you guys do it, but this one I'm not going to chop it apart from this part. This I'm going to chop this part, then this part I want to chop it. Come and show them. This one we don't need it. It's going to be like a residue. This one. And then I'll just chop <coughs> chop this. guys please consider subscribing to my channel like share and comment premier gun you're the best thank you so much for always supporting me i really appreciate Hey, Tim Harriet, you're the best. You guys are very loving. Mm -hmm. If you're enjoying this video, drop a comment right now. Okay? Yeah. 
yeah so this is what i'm going to give out this one i'm not going to cook it i only need this yeah like this so let me also chop this one and yeah i'll see you guys so i'm done chopping the first cabbage guys this is the second one i have to do it first because this one is already on fire this one here. So guys, as I chop um, the cabbages, my co-chips are helping me with turning the cabbages over there. Going to first let it first steam a bit it's going to first steam and then i add in my cooking oil some little cooking oil and then i add in my ingredients guys like that it's going to um steam a bit see it's actually changing i think you guys can tell that right now it's changing wow the aroma mm -hmm. The aroma I'm perceiving right now is just giving. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to give it like uh, five minutes to steam. And then, actually, it's bringing some soup. See? Down here, it's bringing soup like its own. See? So all this one has to first dissolve. And then I add in my cooking oil. So guys, I don't know how you do it, but for me, when I'm cooking food, I usually remove off this top skin, this one here. I remove it off, and this is how I do it. Some people put it in, they first cook the tomatoes, like the way they, and then they just peel it off. But me, this is how I do it here. The reason why I chop, up, I chop off this top layer is because I want my tomato to dissolve very well in the, you know, in my sauce yeah so i don't need this hard skin when i'm cooking so drop a comment how do you uh cook your tomatoes do you remove off the top layer or you just cook it the way it is drop a comment guys for me this is how i do it So, I'm going to be chopping all this. So, these are my e, my spices. Okay, let me also chop this off. This one, the carrot. how I chop my carrots like this I don't 
have a chopping board guys that's why i'm using this you know if i had a chopping board i'll show you as well since i don't have one like that guys please remember to subscribe to my channel like the video share and drop a sweet comment for the Let me first chop all these guys and then I'll show you the final results. Yeah, so guys, as I cook my sauce, I'm also going to be cooking the rice. Since the water is now ready, when you're cooking rice, you have to first boil your water for it to cook very fast. Yeah, so this is how I do it. So this actually we are using a kettle. I don't know you guys, do you have kettles wherever you're watching me from? But for us here in Uganda, we use a kettles like so much so i've cooked my water in my kettle after it has finished boiling i think you can see the steam coming out like over there so that one shows that it is now ready to be used so um this is my saucepan i'm going to first let it cool uh, this. so i'm going to cook rice it is over here this is my rice one but i'm going to first wash it my rice is here how much is it so you first have to wash your rice that is how i cook it drop a comment guys let me know how do you cook your rice you first wash it the way i'm doing it here the reason why i wash it is because um sometimes it be dirty that's the reason why i wash it like so i want to be putting it in my saucepan So my rice is going to be vegetable rice. Make sure it's very, very clean. I rinsed it twice. This was the second water, guys. So right now I'm going to be adding in my water. I first boiled it. guys drop a comment let me know how do you do it me most of the time i use my eyes to measure but some people use cups to measure passing it on fire a little bit we added some cooking oil i think you can see the cream on top that's the cooking oil so i wasn't paid to advertise the company so i can't talk about their brands mm. so after i'll add in it's going to be vegetable rice guys so right here i have my onions i have my carrot i have my green pepper and tomatoes so I'll just add in my onions. And then the carrot. So everything is going to cook together. And then I'll also add in the green pepper. So this is the vegetable rice. I'm going to give it some minutes to cook and then you guys will see the final results but basically this is how you cook your vegetable rice here in Africa let me know drop a comment show the camera here guys drop a comment and let me know how do you prepare your rice wherever you're watching from and please don't forget to subscribe like the video share and comment drop a sweet comment for your girl so guys, let me add in my cooking oil in the cabbages. Okay, after 
turning somehow goldish. Then that one shown. They are now well prepared. So after I'll add in after I'll add in my onions. Then also the tomatoes at once. Third. Everything is going to cook once. I also have my garlic here, guys. Also my garlic. I'm going to chop it. Hey guys, the aroma smells already nice. So when I'm cooking most of the time, when I'm cooking sauce, the green pepper always comes last because it brings that nice aroma. So it always comes last. Let me also put the salt. Yes, how does it smell? <laughs> so I want to create gravy. So I'm going to first leave the tomatoes to dissolve. We are now trying to turn our rice so that it doesn't burn down and this is how you do it. Guys we have added now the water and then the green pepper so that's how it looks. We want the gravy. Then we are using a banana leaf to cover our rice. Like that. Yeah. Yeah. That is it. Guys, cool. come and show them. These are my cabbages. These are my cabbages over here. And then this is my rice. So this is how you do it. Get your rice, get the cabbages. Mm. Nice. Is it nice? Yes. Cut us of Harriet. <laughs> so guys, hope you have enjoyed the video and um, that was it for this video. As for me, I'm, enjoy I'm already enjoying the dish. I know my family is also going to enjoy the food. So I think that is it for this video. Thank you so much, everyone who has watched up to the end of this video. We love you so much. And please subscribe if you haven't already. Like, share, and comment. Drop a sweet comment for your girl. I love you all. We shall see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs>